brand new games are in, these are gonna be awesome for business. What do you think of them, Pixel? I did pick the nice ones, didn't I? Yeah, Dad, they look nice, but how do they play? Are the games fun, or are they old, boring games that you would like to play? Whoa, hey, 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 I have good taste in games, and your dad's not old. Well, looks like the joke's on you, Pixel. The new arcade heroes is the hottest game of the moment. Yeah, I saw it on Gamer's Digest. What do you know about Gamer's Digest, with over your cutie? Haven't been stealing my magazines, have you? Uh, it's a no. Well, quit yapping and unbox them so we can play. Hello everyone, today we are in our arcade and we are going to be unboxing the brand new LOL Surprise Arcade Heroes. These are so cool because they're arcade games. We can use them in our DIY arcade room and on the inside we've got some brand new brothers for our sisters, including one girl and I don't know whose sister she is but we are going to figure that out. Here they all are, we have six to the series and I went ahead and grabbed six on walmart.com so they did choose them randomly for me I couldn't choose them myself and it looks like you can see which doll you're gonna get on the front of the game box so we're getting two of VR Cuties brothers and we will be missing one of the boys. So I'm gonna have to go on a hunt for that to see if I can complete the series. Each of these go for $16.99 here in the US. And at first I thought maybe the box would be a paper play set, but it's actually hard plastic. So that is the cool thing that we could use the box over for play. We get a six piece hero suit and we've also got extra items looks like we've got a game card water bottle and a few other accessories oh he's got removable underwear and it's looking like Fanime's got a brother these are gonna be pretty huge because this is the actual size of the doll with the hero suit on of course all right here we go with our first one it is our girl arcade hero and look I didn't even notice the little joystick and the game buttons on the front let's take the sleeve off oh look how cool she looks I think she has a glittery hero suit and here are the stuff that comes with her her box is the glittery silver one All right here we go with the front oh and the very front we can see her these are so so cool here's the first bag we've got a game controller kind of looks like a retro game boy what have we in here? It's our coin. It's such a cool glittery gold coin. What does it say on it? No cash value. That's what the real coins say in real arcades. And on the front, we've got a slice of pepperoni pizza and it says United States of pizza. One slice slash point. I'm really excited about this arcade game machine actually being a part of the toy and not just paper. Whoa, look how cool the side is. This is gonna look so nice in my arcade. Or should I say, the Arcuties arcade. Look at that, the side is perfect. I love the colorful animation with the other arcade heroes. Here's the front, this is just too cute. It's a retro arcade machine. And on the side, we've got her permanently stickered onto the game machine. All right, so it's asking us to insert the coin. Let's pop that in. And I think something's gonna pop out of here. Oh, you put your coin in and this pops open and you can get to your doll. Wow, ooh, look how cool this is. Wow. Well, here's her player card. It says Starling, so I guess that's her name. What else have we got? We've got the back of the machine. I don't think that's removable. Whoa, it's actually her in gameplay. She's from the Glitterati and it's Infinity Queen and she becomes Starling. That is her alter ego. We've got the STEM club. Of course, we have VR Dude and he turns into Cyber and Gear Guy who turns into Titanium. Gear Guy, I think, think is can do baby's brother here's cool cat who is a baby cat's brother he turns into claw as an arcade hero and fanboy is fanime's brother turns into atomic in the cosplay club we had cool cat in the theater club and for the storybook club we've got baddie bro she gets a brother he turns into chaos 
So who is our ultra rare? It's Infinity Queen, of course, and we've got her right over here. On the back, we've got a very cool gaming poster with all of them sparkle unlocked. She reminds me, well, I mean, all the arcade heroes remind me of Buzz Lightyear. Their suits totally look like a Buzz Lightyear space suit, but here she is. She's so much taller than a regular LOL surprise doll. Here is VR Cutie with the arcade suit VR Cutie can be this tall too. Maybe her brother will let her borrow his game suit. Wow, you're mega cool. Thank you, fellow girl. And even better than that, they can stand on their own. You guys know LOLs are so hard to stand. Those little babies keep toppling over. Here's her little under outfit. Super cute. But where's her outfit? I think her outfit may be inside here. Let's roll this back around for a second. So this was supposed to be our game screen, but there's something in there. Oh, okay. Here is where all of her things are. Oh, I don't want to mess up the game screen. So we're going to have to take it out this way. That's going to kind of mess up our... Yep, that is going to mess up our game screen. All of her glittery accessories. Here is her little outfit. Very cute with holographic glitter. She also comes with an extra outfit. Here is her tiny cute little backpack and her shorts plus her juice box and her sweet little boots. See, she's even got a space pack on the back like Buzz Lightyear. So to get her inside her space suit, we've got to take everything off. I figure we get her head in first. She's got cat ears. She looks like she's either about to ride a motorcycle or she is going to space. Here is the front of her suit. Okay, worked it like Legos. Here's the back. Let's connect the two pieces and listen for the clip. Okay, so they've clicked together. Here are her arms with her tiny little hands. Look at the little fingers they gave them. Oh, so let's get the front of the arms in. And then we're going to connect with the back of the arms, which is right over here. There you go. She's got her right arm on. Now here's the leg piece. We're going to get this on one side of the leg. Here we go. And connect it with the back side. Easy peasy. If you like building with Legos and you like LOLs, then you have both of them in one. And I like how it's articulated. You can move the legs and the arms too, even when she's in her suit. For her water surprise, she is actually a spitter. So here are the controllers for that. It's so neon, I love it. And we've got VR Dude here on the side, or should I say Cyber, because he becomes Cyber once he wears his suit. And here goes the rest. So we're gonna get our coin out. Same gold coin, and we're gonna open this up. Ooh, VR Dude. Oh, he's got black lipstick on, just like his sister. It looks like it's black or brown lipstick. I'm not wearing lipsticks. Don't say I wear lipsticks. Look at my green and blue eye. Oh, he's right. He has one green eye and one purple, maybe blue eye. So cool. And he's a color changer. He changed right underneath my thumb. I really do like the colors of his suit. Here he is. He comes with these little shorts. Oh, I see what you did, MGA. You're guarding his modesty now. So the boys got little underwears on. MGA listens. I think some parents had some issues with the boys' booties hanging out. So they put little undies on them. He's got little socks and he's got a cute teal checkered top on. I really do like VR Dude. I think it's really cool. Hey, I have a brother now! Yeah, yeah, you just don't be stealing my stuff, okay? So you can't, you can't take my games if I don't tell you you can take them. Ooh, uh, it's, uh, well, well, you don't take my games. I won't, I don't play girl games. Well, I don't play, I don't play girl games, I play games. And games are for everybody. Um, I don't think so. Oh, I don't, I don't like him already. Here's Cyber and VR Dude on the back. He's a level five. Infinity Queen was a level eight. Oh, cool, look at his pants. I love his outfit. <gasps> and he has bubble tea. Okay, he's my favorite. Definitely my favorite. He's got a better headset than me. Speaking of headset, if you guys haven't joined the Game Squad, head on over to my gaming channel. I will leave the link in the description box. 
We play lots of Roblox over there and lots of Adopt Me. Anyways, here are his cute little pants. I love these. I wanna put that on him. I think it'll look so nice with his top. Oh, that looks so much cooler. And his sneakers and his headset. He looks like the ultimate gamer boy. They look so cute together. He does complete the family very nicely. Damn, the Koopa's member, of course. You are dude. Okay, you've been totally negative since you came here. You need to bring on the positive vibes, okay? Okay. Will you game with me? Do you know how to game? Of course I do. I'm VR Cutie. I'm the very first VR gaming doll there was. Oh, yes. And we don't want to forget his top right here. Totally forgot it. Now here's the complete VR dude. Oh, yeah. The top totally completed him so nicely. On second thought, I'm going to keep the other VR dude just for his accessories. Because we're going to need to have more headsets than just the one. Especially if he's going to be gaming with friends. Yeah, totally. So since I noticed he changed underneath my thumb that means he's a heat color changer let's get him in the water wait a second he didn't change is that ombre just a part of his hair well okay then let's try the cold water now let's get him in the cold water what do we have it says he's a color changer oh oh i see a color change on his shirt his shirt says player one so who's player two? Is that VR cutie? And he's got pink squares on the rest of his shirt. Ooh. I wonder if these game sets are a perfect size for VR cutie and our other LOLs who aren't going to be wearing hero suits. Well, they're okay. Yeah, they're going to have to stand on their little teepee toes to get there. Oh, man. Look at my son, the strapping hero that he is. Sweetie, please take your arcade suit off and go help your sisters with the arcade. Yeah, VR dud. It's not VR dud, it's VR dude. I can't get it right. Wow, are you a real superhero? Yes, I sure am. Next up, let's unbox Fanami's brother. Whoa, look at his suit. It's metallic. You know what these also remind me of? They remind me of Transformers. Transformers, robots in disguise. Here we go. Look at his hair. Look at the detail they put in there. I like it. It's a new hairstyle for the boys. Oh, he's just too precious. Look at that little face. And his hair is just too cute. It fits Fanami perfectly. And little undies. And he's got a water surprise. Let me show you guys before we put his clothes on. He's not a cold water color changer. Let's go with the warm water. Will we see any color change? Yep. Oh, he's got a color change. It's the picture on the back of his shirt, but it's more noticeable now. The kitty cat with little hearts. Let's get him back in the cold water. Doesn't really conceal itself too much. Okay, moving on to his outfit pieces. Here they are. Oh, he's got a bottle of chocolate milk and a fanny pack. So here are his plaid pants, his fanny pack, chocolate milk, his top and his sneakers. His top is similar to what he has on right now. Here he is, all dressed up. He looks preppy and cute. And he actually reminds me of Ash from Pokemon. So here is Batty Bro. Everything is looking like it's green on him. And he becomes Chaos as an arcade hero. Batty Bro. Here are his outfit pieces. Everything's green. And it looks like he's got a book in there. Let's check out his accessories. He's got a bottle of Bad Sip. And there's Batty Monkey. He's got DC Comics. Or is that is that DC Comics? It's BB Comics The Amazing Batty Monkey is one of his games. It looks like a book, but I think it's a game. Here are his shoes. His pants. Whoa. They say bad, but look how detailed they are. And here's his top. Here's his little undies, his socks. He's got a netted top on that says bad. So here he is with the entire look. And Batty Bro is a spitter. And finally, we've got Cool Cat. And here he is. Same hair color as Baby Cat and same eye color. Here's the back of his suit. Oh, look at his underpants. His underwear is so cute. Does he actually have a sleeve of tiger print? He does, it's not a full sleeve, but he's got tiger prints on his arm and he's also got a silver chain 
a devil emoji on his top and checkered orange underwear that goes along very nicely with his socks and his hair and everything. Here are his accessories. He's got a tiger print top and orange soda for his water bottle. Gray jeans, a skateboard with a flame and tiger print on the bottom and blue sneakers. He kind of reminds me of Tony the Tiger from Frosted Flakes, the cereal. So here is his full look and he's got his skateboard to go along with his whole look. And he is also a spitter. And there you have it. We've got all of the arcade heroes except for one. We're missing gear guy, which I will find. It's going to be easy because we could see who we're getting in the box. Yep, I chose the games. Okay, Dad. Yeah, they did turn out really nice. Good job, honey. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Click the thumbs up button. Join me on my other channels. I will leave them in the description box. And until next time, I will see you later. Bye for now.